up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Brittany or Puma's Revenge here and today as you can tell from the title we're going to be talking about Nuketown in Black Ops 4. Now if you live under a rock, Nuketown was announced yesterday Friday November 9th to come to Black Ops 4. Obviously we already knew it was coming to Black Ops 4 but we didn't know when and today I can actually share the details with you as I'm sure you guys have been slammed in your inbox from yesterday that everybody's been making Nuketown content but you know what, I do it the day after because I'm lame and I didn't have time, so that's my excuse. But PlayStation users will be able to play Nuketown on Tuesday, November 13th, which is just in a couple days, and Xbox and PC will have it available to them a week later on Tuesday, November 20th. Now, we don't know much about the map, we don't know everything about it, but what we do know from one of the first teasers back in the day from Treyarch is that Nuketown will take place in Russia and will have a snowy environment. That's not much info, I'm sure there's more out there, I just don't have it in my brain. But for now, that's what I know and that's what I'm gonna go for, I'm not trying to spoil myself, I just wanna play the map, man. Now what you guys should be excited for is Nuketown 24-7, obviously that always comes into the game whenever Nuketown is released. And that stuff, man, that's addicting. I could sit there for hours and just play Nuketown because it's just, it's a fun map, man. But for now, I know we still have about four more days until we can actually play Nuketown for us PlayStation users. But, I mean, at least we still have Fire Range, Jungle, Slums, and Summit to enjoy from the Black Ops series. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that is really all I have for you guys today. Very short video, but if you did enjoy, go ahead and drop a like down below and maybe even subscribe. Hopefully you guys have an awesome day and I will definitely see you guys later.